Hey everybody, welcome back to some more Fire Emblem. So, I decided to turn Garcia into a hero, so he can use swords and axes, and it... I don't know. It, he gained uh, two points of defense, and I think two points of resistance? I figured the shield thing kind of might have... I was judging based on looks, I figured it might give him more defense going that route. Besides, it does make him a little more versatile, and the thing with having axes and bows is, yeah, he gets a ranged attack, but then if he has the bow equipped, he can get attacked, you know, he can he can get attacked at point blank and not be able to counterattack, whereas he can just lob an axe at somebody and he still has a ranged attack. Um, that and he'll, you know, just try to mix things up a little bit. Um, the goddess icon I gave, I used on, uh, Erica. Pretty much all the stat boosting items I find, I'm going to use on Erica. I know it's the usual, you use your stat boosters on your main character, blah, 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 but the thing is, if she dies, the game's over, so, you know, using a stat booster on her <clears throat> is basically a permanent effect, whereas if I use it on somebody else and they get killed, I just lost it. That's my reasoning behind that. The Carapalin Range. Or however the fuck you say it. According to Ewen, a little-known passage to Johanna lies there. Hidden within its cracked red bedrock and knife-edged peaks. Apparently, Gandalf or Dumbledore lives there, or whatever his fucking name is. To avoid Carcino in combat, Erica's troops take to the mountain path. And there's monsters and butt bandits up there, so we're probably going to get into combat anyway. They begin climbing higher and higher towards Carapalin. Unbeknownst to the group, hordes of dark creatures now roam the peaks. Go figure. The Creeper Darkness. Ooh, Valter's here. Being a creeper. Oh, it's all foggy and stiff. We're almost there. Come on. My teacher lives just up ahead. Why am I reading this part? I don't know. Fucking text crawls. Boy. Ugh. But I have to be a dick to everybody! That's where Diablo lives. What sound? The <laughs> the song of the infected. Seize! Prepare for battle! <laughs> I don't want to take you. You just dance and stuff. I mean, 
I have no idea what you actually do or if you have something to upgrade you. Although I might wind up just taking you just because, I don't know. <laughs> You're too young. Your fireballs suck. You're not ready for this. Probably not. Um, give him a voluntary? No! Really? <laughs> I know I hear zombies and stuff, but I'm gonna go to sleep here in the creepy basement. Ronick probably got eaten. My dwarf senses be tingling. There be zombies and shit wandering around. Yeah, it's because you're dumb. But I'm guessing you're probably the Trabador that joins the party. At least he's hyped up and happy about murder. Okay, so who gets to come along? Tethys, Garrick, Innis, Seth, Joshua, Natasha... I don't have the little shit with me, do I? Um... Uh, well... I guess I could take her just to give her experience. Yeah, I'll take her. Mm. Yeah, those guys... Those guys got the armors. Wait. I mean, Tasha's out, so... Oh boy, treasure chest I can't do anything with. So, oh. Yeah, you don't need to be there. And you don't need to be there. And you sure as fuck don't need to be there. Actually, something's probably going to come up through here and be a dick, so... Uh... Actually, something tells me that I need to get to them. So, I might want to walk him, Uncle Gilliam, down this way. Wait, is that a... Oh, it's road, okay. Road, plain, forest, forest, okay. The Creeper Darkness. Get it on! Beep! Oh wait, I didn't give her any items. <laughs> oh well.
Oh, hi! I fit. <laughs> well, we just clogged that hole. Oh crap! Did I? Hit? Oops! I didn't restock his uh his stuff. Arthur, go play arrow bait. Oh no, you scratched him. He didn't like that. <laughs> So, like, all the weak ones are down there attacking them. Oh wow, I actually poisoned him? <laughs> 